for Au Pair Andrew, who has uh, finished his three months Au Pair program. Uh, we'll go back to his country next week. And uh, can you introduce yourself, Andrew? My name is Andrew Shahidi. I am uh, from Dallas, Texas, United States. And I just recently graduated from the University of North Texas. And now I'm here in China. Uh, why did you decide to come to China? Um, at my university, I have a lot of friends from China. They uh, are exchange students, and I met them. They introduced me to their culture. Uh, they told me about a lot of different opportunities to come here um, because English is so, um, it's really in demand in China. People, especially their kids, they want to learn English. So I figured that would be a great way to get a uh, cultural inclusion into China was through um, an English program. Cool. Uh, can you tell us about the host family or the family child? Um, the host family was extremely accommodating. Um, I felt like I was home. I felt like they were my real mom and dad. Um, and the kids were adorable, they're cute, um, they're, they're full of energy, and they're just really fun to, fun to hang out with and uh, help with their English too. It's really fun uh, teaching the kids uh, some English words. Why did you choose Oparia? I chose Oparia because uh, it seemed like a very friendly program. Um, also, the, uh, it was a very cost-efficient way of coming to China. And it, was, uh, it wasn't too long of a period. It was three months. Uh, and uh, flights are paid for. You have insurance. You have uh, accommodation. You have breakfast, lunch, and dinner provided by the family. And a monthly... Um, uh, monthly allowance too, uh, which is what more can you ask for, guys? Come on. <laughs> what have you enjoyed most about the experience here? Um, I think besides being fully Im immersed into the culture with the host family, that's the most important aspect of this experience. But it was the Mandarin classes, um, where during the three months I got to take classes at Beijing Foreign Studies University, and. Um, learn a good amount of uh, Mandarin, and also meeting the other pairs from different parts of the world. Um, I haven't ever met, I haven't met too many people from different parts of the world, like Portugal or um, Spain, uh, Australia, so it was really cool to meet people from different parts of the world and be really good friends with them. I think that China is an amazing place to come to. It, um, first of all, the population is enormous and the people here are so friendly, they love foreigners. I never had any negative experience with any uh, local people in China. So um, I think it's, uh, if you want to travel somewhere, you want to get a, a big um, cultural uh, inclusion, I think that China is a great place to come to. Uh, how is your Mandarin? Um, I will speak Mandarin. I am a a A little bit of Chinese. <laughs> That's cool. Yeah. Do China's you want great. to share more about your experience China, in China? <laughs> yeah, yeah. So I had a. Uh, a lot of free time. Uh, sometimes my families would go on my family would go on trips, so I maybe had three days, four days. So me and another au pair uh, planned a trip to Shanghai um, for three days, and it's a, also a beautiful city. It's uh, very westernized, um, and so I went to Shanghai. Um, I went to uh, Tianjin for a couple days. Um, and it's just really cool when you have free time, you can uh, take the train, the bullet train. It goes really fast. You can take the bullet train uh, to different cities around China. Um, also, meet some Chinese, uh, meet some local people because um, they can hook you up to different uh, activities. Uh, for example, I play basketball and uh, I met a lot of people, uh, met a local people here that play, also play basketball and they introduced me to a lot of uh, uh, basketball tournaments. and. I um, actually 
placed, and I won some money in a basketball tournament here, so there's some extra money. Uh, meet some local people. Yeah. That's cool. Thank you, Andy. Uh, safe flight. Bye. Bye. Goodbye. <laughs> Yeah. You're probably gonna die. It's so good. It's so it good. is? Really? <laughs>